Oren. Yesterday I was in Las Vegas, and so uh, 9.15, what are we at? Yeah, 9.15 East Coast time is a little early for me, right? <laughs> so I'm expecting a bit more, a bit more of a good morning. Good morning! Good morning. Good morning. That's what I like to hear. Excellent. <clears throat> so um, let's talk about a few things, a little bit about me to, to get started with. Uh, I got all my uh, contact information on here. Please do feel free to reach out to me at any time. Um, naturally, uh, uh, as we get started here, I would typically say please turn off your phones, but in this uh, current world of, of mobile and social, I'm going to ask you to turn on your phones and uh, fire up Hootsuite and, and tweet along with us as we go through here. I'll specifically ask you to do that for a couple reasons now, because, well, I, I'm working on my cop score, right? <laughs> and um, does anybody here know Larry Augustine, CEO of Sugar CRM? He was the founding uh, uh, CEO of, of VA Linux. He's one of the guys who actually coined the term open source. He's the CEO of Sugar CRM today. He and I have a bet on who can get to 60 first on cloud. And as you can see, he's beating me right now. <laughs> so I need your help. That's Sugar Clint, fire away. Let's hear your thoughts about uh, what I have to discuss this morning. So, this number here, anybody know what the significance of this number is? It's the number of days since the internet went public. 1989. Now, the internet may have gone public in 1989, and I wrote my first website in 1992 back in college. But as we all know, the technology behind the internet didn't really hit mainstream until probably more like 1999, 5,000 days ago. That's it. Seems pretty small, comparatively speaking, when we've all spent the majority of our careers working in the internet arena. So what are the four key technology trends right now that's driving modern technology, that's driving the internet, that's driving the things that we're working on? Throw them out. What do you think the top four technology trends are today? Mobile. Mobile, there you go. Cloud. Cloud, I'll take that one. You see it's not on my list, so I'll ignore that one. Um, <laughs> open source. Open source, oh, I like that, I like to hear that. I don't actually hear that that often when I, uh, when I talk about this topic. Top four trends today that are being discussed in the media that are driving technology, that are fueling the growth of technology out of us. Mobile, social, big data, and cloud. And I'd like to talk about these for a few minutes because I think you talked about it just through a second ago. Where is open source? Right? Five years ago, six years ago, when we started Sugar Serum, eight years ago, when, when Mark started uh, uh, Asterix nine plus years ago, open source was certainly the hot topic, but people aren't talking about open source anymore like they used to. Is open source still relevant? Well, I know this particular crowd's gonna say yes, all right? Let's dig into this thought a little bit more here. Let's look first at mobile. Looking at the smartphone market share, right? In fact, I have this slide from a couple years ago that had iPhone beating Android and Android quickly catching up. And today we're living in a world where, where Android has just been dominating the smartphone market share for several years right now, even though everybody loves to talk about the new iPhone 5, though I love the Galaxy uh, 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 commercials that talk about why you're standing in line and that sort of thing. But clearly, open source is driving the mobile market. We all know about Android, right? Uh, we all understand what Google's doing with Android out there in the marketplace, how they're driving development behind uh, the Android phones uh, via open source. But I'd also like to point out how Apple's using open source. Who's got an iPhone in, uh, in the audience right now? Open it up. 
go into uh, uh, settings, general, uh, about, legal, legal notices, scroll your way down, and you see the GPL in there. GPL is helping to power the iPhone. In fact, there's a whole variety of open source technology powering OSX. Does anybody know what OSX is actually built on? The DSD, that's right. Open source is powering mobile. Let's talk about social for a few minutes. <coughs> Facebook, LinkedIn, Twitter. Those are the top three names. You can certainly add more to them. But as we look at each of these technologies, Facebook, with 14% of the world's population, on Facebook is just a mind boggling number. In fact, they started at the same time Sugar Sierra because we're not quite at 15% of the world's population. <laughs> Working on it, though. Working on it. 